this question is a, known as a horizontal circle. We have a car going around a circle. We're looking at it from the top view. And we notice that there, of course, is a circle. Therefore, there must be centripetal force. So the force centripetal will be pointing in this direction. We have to ask ourselves the question, what force would be causing that? And that would be equal to friction force between the tires and the road. So force friction is then equal to force centripetal. And we'll just derive the equation for it. There is a horizontal surface here. So force of friction, again, always being force normal times mu. And of course, that'll equal force centripetal. Force normal, in this case, will be equal to m times g. Since it is a horizontal surface, and multiply that by the coefficient of friction. Now, the formula for force centripetal is m v squared divided by r. OK, and where does that come from? Let's remind ourselves that centripetal acceleration, ac, equals v squared divided by r. If we multiply by mass, we will get a force centripetal. Force centripetal is m v squared divided by r. Now, going back to the question here, masses will cross off. And we'll solve this expression for mu. Mu would then equal v squared divided by gr. 